speedrunners because we get to go fast and we do enjoy going fast. Okay, so I'm going to try and get four teeth now. I already know there's one here. Every time a dog picks up a piece of metal, it's a chance to drop a tooth. I need four in total. What are you doing? You going after me? No tooth on that pickup, no tooth on that pickup. I guess I'll scan this. I've got until 8.20 basically. I need to, I'm gonna need to micromanage, aren't I? What's this dog over here doing? Where did they go? No tooth on that pickup. There's a tooth. So one more and I'll I'll keep going. Are they gonna do one more? Are they just gonna have a little mosey around and do a, not a lot of no, anything? That does sound like the dogs. That sounds like the dogs I know. They ate your metal and bounced. Yep. Tooth? Any teeth over here, buddy? Seconds. Just freeloaders? Oh, hey, Spot. Wait, is that a tooth? No. I guess we're done. Man. I gave you so much time. But it is quite a low chance, so I suppose. Was that a tooth? Uh, I, I don't think I saw this one. That might have been there for quite a while. Hmm. Anywho, back we go. started just based on watching Salvador for a while. <laughs> My first run was like five hours. <laughs> sure. You eventually get used to the uh, the route. So long and thanks for all the metal. Yep. They scarpered. Thieves. Hey, a Koopia man. Welcome, welcome. I understood that reference to JP. <laughs> Always screwing up runs. I know, right? I know. So rough. Attention. Good morning. It's been all right. We got our 41.49, as is, that's our favourite number, 41.38, 41.48, 41.39, 49, around there, those are the best numbers, so three of them so far. But let's try and do it a little bit faster. The counting's so hard, <laughs> I'm going to pop to the loo, I'll be back. Happy birthday! What? Hey, battle! Cheers! Thank you very much. Attention. What resources did the forty-one forty-nine have? It had an eighteen forty-three resources. It was ridiculous. The PCF was bad. Uh, pretty much everything was bad, apart from the resources in that section. Okay, so as long as you... where the... where's my base? What's that? Okay. So, first two limestone are always one copper, one titanium. 
So the second one's whatever you already don't have. But if the first one's copper, you can grab yourself some metal salvage and be on your way. You can actually leave while stuff's making, so we do that there. How'd you get 18 for <laughs> resources? Mmm, I am a wizard. Unfortunately, I can't follow through, so... Uh, let's see if we can get some seagull fragments. Got one all the way over here. What's my mushroom count? Two. Let's grab two more. Sound of resources, Vixit rests. I mean, co op speedrun does sound interesting, but the co op mod does not, so. I do need one more Sea Glide fragment. And I'm surprised they didn't drop a tooth. They normally do if I don't get Sea Glide. As is their want. Uh, no, that's a mobile vehicle bay. Reset. Oh, no, we didn't get to the Brock, Brock Blaking bit. Almost. The beach on holiday all weekend. Oh, nice. <coughs> yeah, we had uh, amazing resources, but bad nickel luck. Um, bad crystal luck. I had to jump off two times to die. We had bad bridge luck. We had bad gold luck. And then I did some awkward crafting at the end. Pretty much all the little things that could go wrong went wrong. Uh, a little really awkward. Okay, so let's grab these rocks. First two limestone, always one copper, one titanium. So with that and a couple of mushrooms, I can make myself a scanner and be on my way. We're a little bit further back than I'd like, but it's not too bad. Why sleep if you have Salmo? So the whole thing was garbage except the resources, pretty much. But resources were nuts. Okay, we're going to head over to the wreck, grab ourselves some sea life fragments. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints. So on the top of the water slightly fast, that's why we do it here. Doesn't mean you don't know where you are, but hey ho. Get the hang of it. Sound is far better than sleep. <laughs> Even run away in the PCF and change his headset batteries. Yes, I did. Okay, we do have two sea glide fragments. One here. What is your summer best? The summer best isn't really achievable, because a lot of splits steal from each other. So if you have a bad one split, that might be because you're getting resources for the next split, because they just happen to be there. But the sum of best is 3651, but it's really not achievable. Okay. Let's go down and grab myself some of these. I do need another sea glide. Do I need another sea glide? I don't actually know. Do I? I got two. I did get two. What am I talking about? Got three dogs there. That's not bad. Okay. Let's grab ourselves some rocks and head on in. You'll notice I'm breaking these rocks a little bit quicker than normal. That's because if you bind the scroll wheel to any one of your actions, you play at higher than 60 FPS. Each scroll cancels multiple inputs. There's there's the copy paste. <laughs> Which is fantastic because normally you'd have to click four times to grab the items inside. But I can just do one scroll. Clove Savner is my favourite multi watch. Yeah, oh, nice. Please give. And we'll head on up. Ooh, hey, another one. Now we'll head on up. And go back to base. 14 hour 53. Is that good? Yeah! Submit it to the leaderboards. Go on. Back to base. from on the top of the water. Slightly faster again. Where do I find these tubes? Um, there's a little map, actually, if you do exclamation mark spawn, I'll show you a little map. And the, the red area is sort of where the tube is. So I'm going to make my next set of tools. Morning, Reggie. Morning, Cat. Okay, so I need five more to do so. I've got seven. 1124 over here in New Zealand. 
Three of these giant tubes. There are three. Yes, you are correct. Going to dump all this. Four and two. That is eight. Because maths. I need 17 to 21 quartz. I need as much lime as I can carry. I need three table coral. Nine, ten, eleven. And I need two silver, two gold. Twelve, thirteen. One silver, one gold. Fourteen. Limestone. Head on through. Any metal salvage would be appreciated. Anything? Nope. Okay. I don't need to go and get them. Fifteen, sixteen. One silver, one gold, please, game. Ooh, have to go to a backup. Big oof. Huge oof. Grab our table crawl. And hopefully this is gold. It is, but I didn't pick it up because there's a crash fish in my way. <laughs> and back to base. And we're going to make our final tool here, the habitat builder. Probably a little bit behind. Without trading it for sleep, <laughs> sure. I think it takes like four seconds, five seconds to build, so maybe we're just on par. Yeah, like slightly ahead, sure. Grab all of these, and I'd love to make some metal. Oh, we got the power to do so. Fantastic. And head on down. Gonna make myself a base. Is there some metal salvage? Because I imagine I need some more. We're the hatch. And a solar panel. Three seconds to craft, sure. And I'm holding down the sprint key to keep that menu open while I'm doing that. Very little useful tip bit. Yeah, ingots and such longer. Yeah. So I'm going to make this base. I need three extra metal compartments and three extra glass ones to flood it, which is what I'm going to do, as as we all should. And I don't have any metal salvage, do I? No. So I need I need to find one. There's one. I'll pick up the mushrooms on the way back. Pick up two. Sure. So I need to make two glass and one more set of metal to finish this base. And I'll put down some lockers as well. I can't make this locker. That's fine. Put down this. You can actually pick up stuff through doors, so we do that here. And we'll make the final glass compartment. And finish this metal one. There you go. And we're going to head over. I need two more mushrooms. And nine table coral. One, two, three, four, five... Oh hey. Six, seven, eight, nine. And some metal salvage would be nice. Gonna go along here. This little ridge normally has some good stuff. And head back. Oh hey. I can only make one, right? I remember. So that normally is going to be my late game locker, but because I can't make it yet, everything's just going to go in here. A lot of copper. I guess I can make another item. It's, it's flooding quite slowly. There you go. So I've just activated a glitch. By being in a base, when it floods, the game thinks I'm both swimming and walking at the same time, so it puts those two speeds together, which is fantastic for us. Because we get to go fast, and boy... Do I enjoy going fast? Hello dogs! Greetings! I am now your new lord and master. Please give teeth! I need four in total. There's one. Every time the dogs bite a, tooth, bite a piece of metal, there's a chance to drop a tooth. That chance is around 15%. There's a second tooth. grab you as well. One more tooth and I'll be fairly happy. There you go. I'll grab this and we'll leave. I'll come back later. I did remember leaving a metal here and there's one here. Good. Whoop. Head on back. I've got a rupture there. That's great. Going to be a lot of people from different places. Yeah, yeah. 
So with this rupture, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go out, I'm going to deconstruct one of the glass compartments. And because I have the silver, I can take this off and upgrade my O2 tank after I built this stuff. The, building those saves a lot of space, that's why we do that now. I'm going to dump all this in here. So I need 5 quartz and 11 minus 5 is 6 copper. Okay, we're going to head on out. And I still need one tooth. Grab a lot of air and head down. So it's going to do copper and quartz, the counting wise. So that's um, 1, 1, 1, 2. And I'm going to grab as much of that as I can. There's always 8 at the top of here. One three, one four, two four, two five. So two. And you're going to take a lot, a uh, tick of damage every second you're near the geyser. Take a lot more if you're in the main blast. So we're going to try and avoid that. Three, four, and I'm going to. I can't look at chat because I need to pay attention to where stuff is. Stuff on the walls. There's one. Five. Six. That's all of them. I know no more limestone breaking for me. Head on through. Just sandstone now. Okay, another little bonus super sea glide is you can rub your face on these stingers as much as you like and they won't hurt you. Same with um, the crash fish just don't know you're here as well, so they're just going to stay in their house. Everything else does know you're around, which is unfortunate, because we'd rather it didn't. But uh, hey-ho. Any more for any more? There's one. Any dog teeth? that one? Yes. Good stuff. Thanks, dogs. I'll just be taking... Oh, I'm full. So that's all my teeth done. And we're going to start making this locker, do some copper crafting. Has that locker done? I think I'm going to make an ingot, so I've just got some time to do some uh, some management of items. We'll dump these, grab some metal so I can make the ingot. Because I need to move the late game items in here. Is that all the lead I ever need? That is all the lead I ever need. Three of these, three of these. Let's make another copper wire. Um, and grab, these are late game. One of these is late game. Let's make a, uh, sure, wiring kit, why not? Late game, late game, late game, late game. I mean, that's technically late game, but not yet. And then this is all early game. Okay, get out of my inventory, you. So I've got uh, five, seven, and six. And that's all the copper I ever need. So 5, 7, and 6. 7 and 6. I should have taken a medkit, really. But here we are. Brave. Soundness from Manchester, you reckon? Yeah, close. Uh, ish. Not really. Um, 7 and 6. So that is 5 silver, 3 gold. I will be counting. No, no lead required, no copper required. So I'm going to go silver, gold. So that's 1. Any more? Any more? There's one. One, one. There's always two in this little cave here. Uh, two, one. There's one over here. And any more? Sometimes there's one outside. Not today. Let's grab some metal salvage. Try not to get bitten. There's two, one. Head on down. There's always three behind this thing. Two, two. Three, two. Four, two. So I need one more silver, one more gold. There's normally three here, but I can't. I can never find the third one. Oh, a metal salvage. Hey. Four, three. So one more silver. There's normally like one in here. No. So I need another silver at some point. I'll keep an eye out. Grab myself some more metal salvage on the way back. Hopefully some mobile vehicle bay fragments if I can. my space like six grab this I'm gonna have a little look for a sandstone just on the walls by going this way uh, nothing okay aren't any American frag emotes on twitch interesting okay I shouldn't be in here what am I doing in here I need to Ooh, hello let's go upstairs so I can eat and just do a lot of crafting. Are there other flag emotes on Twitch? I don't know. Hmm. 
Don't get distracted. <laughs> okay. So we make the metal up here because we have a lot more power in here than in our main base. We're going to grab these and eat them all. Om nom nom. I'm going to grab this and head out. I should probably take this now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some ingots while I deconstruct my base. We're going to make one, then we're going to deconstruct about two and a half. I'm going to aim for all the metal ones because then I can think I can make another ingot. Like so. Yep, there you go. And then we'll deconstruct the rest. There's still a bit of time before daybreak. Good stuff. And let's start making some wiring kits. I'm going to grab all but four of these, so I need to dump one of those. I actually need to grab all but three because I don't have enough. I need to grab all but one of the gold. Make another wiring kit. I'm going to grab all of these. going to grab all but one of these. Make a computer chip. I don't have a lot of power in here. Grab all of these. Grab this. And make another computer chip. And then we'll just head upstairs because we don't have any power. We do have power now because it is dawn in a second. going to spam a lot of clipping here. YouTube is how I found him. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad people are enjoying those videos. This run is going well, right? We, I don't know. Don't speak too soon. Which we try not to. And four enamel glass. And again, leaving while stuff's making. There you go. And we can build our rebreather. Dump all this in here. And this, I guess. So I'm at three. I'm at apparently four. I can make another one. Okay, I will do so. Five and one from the looks of things. Five and one. I need one more silver. I will remember that. I'm gonna go out metal hunting. I'm gonna go this way and then I can pop in to grab some silver. Five and five. Five and nine. I do need some more mobile vehicle blades as well. Six and three, six and seven, seven and one. Head down here to grab some silver. Why is there never any when I come in here? You better not be led. There you go. So seven and seven. Still, we'll head on back-ish. Go past here, normally has a bit. Eight and one, eight and five. Eight and nine. Nine and three. Ah, oh, mobile vehicle very good. That's good. Eight and nine so far. I don't think there was any metal salvage near my base. Or was there one like right behind there? I don't know, I might have to go check. No, I managed to pick them all up. I managed to pick them all up. So I'm just crafting. And then I have to I'm gonna go to the dogs. I think the dogs have a reasonable amount of metal, I believe, because I left a fair bit with them. We're having a geography lesson then. Miscounted the metal, but not sure. Sure. So this is five, six, seven. I'm guessing like eight and one or something. Eight and three, sure. Okay. That's still fine. I can do that. Eight and three. So I'm going to ten and seven. No. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's a tooth. I didn't want that. Uh, eight and seven. 9 and 1. Scan this. 9 and 5. 9 and 9. Two more. There you go. 10 and 3, 10 and 7. Okay. This might be fine. Not as fast as it could be, but still fine. More teeth than needed, yeah. So I'm counting uh, ingots and spare. Basically, I'm gonna grab three of these. I'm gonna dump this tooth because I just don't need it. Sounds like the only British man in stream. Hmm. Grab this, this. This, this, this. And this. Dump this, 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 this. Yep. Okay. And off we go to the Aurora. I hope I have eight and seven. Mm. 
I might actually look. So we're going to go to the Aurora, and we're going to learn a little bit, about, little bit about dying. When you die, you get to keep all the items you had. When you were last in the base, as well as one additional random item, and that random item is going to be a Metal Savage. I'm going to pick up in a second, hopefully. Generally, there's one. There you go. It's a little bit worrying. I'm going to go through this maintenance hatch. Definitely intended. Crawling through the ventilation shafts like uh, some sort of secret agent. I'm going to find ourselves a prawn bay. It's over here somewhere. So there's the locker room. And in the prawn bay, we line ourselves up. We go straight up. Perfect. Y box. 2679. Get out the way box. Is always the code. Grab the final blueprint and jump over the box to die in this fire. Okay. No. Seven. Sure. Do I have the mobile vehicle bay yet? Does anyone know? What's the symbol that comes up if you have it when you put your point your scanner to it? You have, yes, okay, I won't get a scanner then. If this is if this is a ploy, well played. But uh, thank you very much. Okay, we're gonna head over to the mountain island now. If you don't know where it is, you can look at the Aurora, you look left, you'll find yourself a cloud, and that is where the mountain island is. I've got some cues just swimming underwater that I use, but that is the easiest way to do it. We're gonna go get ourselves a lot of items now. Grab a lot of air and go straight down. Chat is too couple up in countries to know. Hmm. Grab this tablet, and it's so beautiful I just have to rub it on my face. I have to. Hmm. I'm going to grab some lithium now. I want about seven or eight. And hopefully some gold as well. One so far. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, seven. Oh, hey, Mr. Warper. I'm going to build a base right here, really inconspicuous like, and stop, 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 no, stop, stop. I do not want to hug. No hugs. No hugs. And then I'm going to drop some items. And it's all going to be fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two. Okay, we're going to go on. Please stop. I hope you haven't teleported my items. I need them. I'm going to grab some more lithium here. I'm going to grab six. There's one. There's two. I can grab some more later. And we're looking for moon pool and engines. That's a rock. That's an engine. And there's a moon pool right next to it. There's another engine. Can't see there's engines over there. I'll be going over there then. And there's a moon pool. Good stuff. So we're all good here. I grabbed two lithium, so I want another four. And there's normally a good amount up here. There's one. Uh, two. Hmm. Three. So I want one more. No, maybe the Reaper's got one. Sometimes the Reaper has one. Hey Reaper, you got one? You do. Thank you, Reaper. Now please don't kill me. Okay? We have we have an agreement. Right? I'm gonna go get some gear. Air. Reaper Chan, please. <laughs> okay. We're gonna get some lovely air. And then go down. About here. Past this big bulb. We'll lose a little bit of time, but that's fine. I don't, I don't think it's that, that matters that much. Grab this bulb and head on. It's going to be all about the... Um, what's the reason? Where's this reason you died? Uh, I mean, the weirdest way you can die is drowning while you're dying. That's the weirdest way you can die in this game. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but it happens. So grab a couple more plants there, and then we're going to have a little stroll.
So you've already died and then you drown. It's very odd. Um, yeah, there's a rip section. You can you can watch those. Oh boy. I'm going to do a little bit of inventory management here. My power's quite low because I've used the light a lot this run. But that's fine, so we, we don't really need it. I'm going to dump this and this. And I'm going to carry on. We see out of Casper. Casper's the friendliest ghost of the Varathon. Sometimes Casper says hi back. Hello? Sometimes? No, wow, rude. Is that high? Maybe. So I'm looking for some nickel. Nickel's a tiny little thing and it likes playing hide and seek. It's small, so it generally wins. And I need three of it. So there's one. There's two. That's pretty good going. Just a third now, please, game. Just a third. There's the third. Good stuff. We'll carry on. So rude, Casper. Man. That dragon's a little bit close, but I'm sure it's fine. So we're going to go over to here. Build a lovely moon pool right on top of this lava. Just where you'd want to. So I can't currently take damage from lava, because I've got Super Sea Glide. So we're going to hop in here, lose Super Sea Glide, hop down, die. I'm going to respawn fast enough that that base hasn't yet flooded, because it does flood at this different distance. This this depth. I'm going to dodge the... Uh, Dodge the ladder, take a lot of damage on this, go back up, it's now flooded, we can get Super Sea Glide, we can move on. Okay, a lot of stuff. That's that's one of the, the trickiest tricks, and it's not that hard, so... Okay, we're going to grab some crystals and some sulfur, hopefully. One sulfur. Two sulfur. I need four crystals right now, the four sulfur can come later. Three sulfur. Four sulfur. Crystals, please. Crystals, please. One crystal. Two crystal. Crystals. Three crystal. Four crystal. Man, I had to do a lot for that. Okay. There's an entrance over here, though, so it's not terrible. Excuse me, are you clipping through walls again? Ooh, that jump was big. I'm sure we're fine. So another thing about dying is if you die in one of these bases, you get to keep all your items. Which is nice. So all those crystals I just picked up, I get to keep. Gonna open this door. And sometimes the sea glide go runs away, because it doesn't like doors. And we're gonna go get a blueprint inside this power station. And dying will respawn back at that moon pool. Okay, we deconstruct this, and we're going to be on our way. I have all the resources I need, so I'm just going to go straight there. Because I already picked up all the sulfur. I can't fail the suicide, yes, I have hardly any health. Off we go. Will we have saved any time? I don't know. Hey, Leo. Maybe, maybe a little bit of time, if I can do this quickly. So I don't actually have the ingredients to go inside here, so I'm just going to spam jump on this, get jumped straight through, go out so I can jump out of the way so I can swim again, and then we're going to carry on. If you don't jump out to swim again, you will just fall, and it'll be very sad. I'm going to swim through here. Okay. Mm. Can still save t some time. We lost some time there because of the search for the crystals, which was rough. Okay. So you can't get. This is a cutscene. You can't get out of it until she says they played. It's a time limit thing. We're gonna go down. We're gonna build a moon pool down here because we did have to leave the water to get in here. So we're currently a little bit slow. I think we can save a second here or something though, so it's not too bad. I'm gonna make myself a moon pool, swim down while I'm crafting it. And while I'm waiting for it to flood, I'm gonna activate this hatching platform. There we go. So it should be flooded as soon as I get back. I'm gonna hop in, get Super Sea Glide, and move. 
I'm going to get a crystal so we can leave, and the final ingredient for the hatching enzymes, uh, this thing, and head on out. Now normally you have to wait for this nice lady to blow the sand away so you can leave, so but we're just going to do it ourselves. We're impatient. So I'm going to just dip down in here and open the door. With Super Sea Glide you can slightly clip through everything, not all the way, but slightly. So you can clip in there and see that, and then you can activate it so you get teleported inside and use it. I will give you One hour later than last Wednesday. That means nothing to me. Oh look, someone built a really nice base here. How kind of them. Who could have done that? So I'm going to wait for a cutscene to end. You'll notice this weird little sparkles on the edge of my screen. That means something's still going on. Then I can make this and deconstruct it for the gold. Thank you. It was you, you built it. Oh, thanks! I'm going to grab all of these. Lovely. Leave the diamonds, because I hate diamonds. I hate them. What time? What, what does that mean? What time does that mean? 7.30 for Salmon. Okay. I can probably do that. We're going to go up, grab Super Sea Glide again. That's why we left that here. Going to hatch the babies. And even though there's an animation for them to hatch, they're actually already outside. They can teleport. Little bonus of being emperors of the sea, I suppose. Can't you build a fabricator in the moon pool? You can, but the moon pool doesn't have any power. There's power there because it has a solar panel. So we're going to go in here, grab some air and save our inventory, and we're going to deconstruct... We don't really grab any air. We can deconstruct this. That doesn't really matter to us. Do a little bit of inventory management. Take this off. Do this. And we're going to head on in. So another thing about this game, when you die and it can't find the last base you're in, for example, it doesn't have a hatch, it's going to put you in the life pod. The life pod's currently over a thousand meters away, so that's quite nice for us. So that's why we take off this O2 tank so we can drown a little faster. And a lot of the walls in this area are sort of advice rather than rules. So we can just swim on through quite happily. And we're going to go turn off a gun that I think is relevant. Uh, I don't really know. It's just a button and I want to push it. So here we are. Yeah, the crystals were, were rough. They, they lost us a bit of time. We can save time on the end though. Or we could get another 4148 and live the dream of three... For actual 4148s and a 4149. Truly. That is the best thing. So I'm going to loo a little bit of stuff before I die. So normally you only get to keep one item, but if you have any storyline items, you get to just keep them anyway. So these are both storyline uh, story items, so I'm going to get to keep both. And I have 6, 10, 13, and 3 gold. So I need 1 lithium and 1 gold. It's highly advised you turn off the gun. You reckon? I don't know. I don't know. So you can actually put on this while you're uh, drowning, so like that, and we're going to leave. Wait, what? What's the button to go back? Is it 8? I think it's 8. Um, grab this, grab this, reactivate Super Sea Glide. Is it 8? Anyone know? What a great unachievable time. It's eight or seven. Eight? Yes, eight. There you go. Okay. I'm gonna head on. A bit too far left. That's fine. Is that a time capsule? Grab ourselves some salt and we're gonna head up for air. And get a lot of get a lot of it and carry on this way. We're going to find this guy. He's guarding a cave. One gold, one lithium. Yep. So we go a little bit past him. Then we go straight down. Hmm. One gold, one lithium. And two rubies. One ruby. One lithium. One lithium. Another lithium that I don't need. 
two rubies, two of those, and a gold. So we're all set. We're going to head on out. Another gold is, is fine if we can get it, but I don't need it. Go down here, grab some cubes for later. I only need three because I've already picked up one. So we're going to grab one and two and three. And go left and right then left again. And we're going to find ourselves a wreck. But I don't like wrecks, to be honest. I'm not a fan. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make it disappear. Goodbye, wreck. And then I'm looking for three bridge, three hull. So one bridge, one hull. Another hull, another bridge. Nope. Grab this. There's a bridge and there's a hull. So that's us done. There's actually two over here. I'm going to get these instead. Bridge. A hull, sorry, and bridge. I'm going to go find a little cave with some, some mushrooms in. This thing here. One, two, three. And build ourselves a compartment. With a hatch. Go inside to save our inventory. Leave. Deconstruct the hatch so it no longer counts as a base. And then die on some shrooms. Lovely. Okay. There we go. So I'm going to start making some items now. Grab all these. Grab these. The extra tooth. Hmm. Grab all of these. And start making some plasteel. I need to grab these three and this. Make another plasteel. I'm going to do a little bit of. Um, I need to do a little bit of uh, battery management in a second. We'll do that now. Grab this battery. Swap this out. We'll make a uh, polyaniline, take out the battery of this, dump the scanner, make another plasteel. I need to grab four of these. Make another plasteel, grab these two. Make another plasteel. I need to grab the, um, the crystal and the silver. So I can make, I need to make that power cell. You are right, you are right game, you are right. And now let's make a uh, ion battery. I'll grab this now. I, am, I might need it. We'll make a, uh, another ion battery. I need to make some more plasteel. I need to make one more set of plasteel. Uh, I need to make another ion battery now. Let's do that now. And another ion power cell. And then we're going to make our mobile vehicle bay. While this is making, I'm just going to double check. Yes. I need to deconstruct this when it's done. Oh, cheers here for nuke. I need to reactivate Super Sea Glide. Gonna head on out. Cheers, Leo. And we're gonna go deep enough so I can build this thing. Hop up to lose Super Sea Glide. And put down the Noble Vehicle Bay. And enjoy your life, Podzard. And then we're going to go back, grab some more items, make a couple more as well. Make an ion battery and an ion power cell. Art is literally always here, yeah, definitely. And we'll grab three of these, all of these, all of these. All of these. There you go. Reactivate Super Sea Glide and off we go. And we're going to do new new jumping strats. So we go here, we do a low one. Oh, I meant to do a low one, but that's fine. And we can activate it from here. Then go and make the Cyclops. You need to build it deep enough. Um, 
I don't know exactly where, but this is... If you deploy it and you can't build it, it's real bad, so I want to be sure. All I can hear from Salvo is all the repeat. <laughs> okay, so we're going to stand here. You can build it in low water. You can't build it in low water. Yeah. yeah. You have to go quite far out. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. We're going to go inside the Cyclops. We need to go inside the Cyclops to make a shield generator that you can only make inside a Cyclops. We're going to do that. You do need a power cell to make it, but thankfully, the Cyclops comes with a load of free ones, which is nice of it. And out we go. You can actually grab that anywhere in the Cyclops once you start making it, so we just leave. We flee, and the item finds us. And then we're going to go back on here. Up we go. Come on. You have to stand still and normal click this. You can't scroll wheel. Uh, there you go. And up the elevator. 41, 48 height. Very excited to be flung off this. That'd be nice. And hop. Some, yeah, place your bets on time. We've got a 41.32, 41.17, stuff like that. We're going to pull some levers, and then we're going to go upstairs. There's the ladder. Is this sub-41? No. No. Oh. Oh, it might be. Oh, okay. Okay. I knew I could save time at the end, but I didn't realize it's it's this much. So we're going to activate these two. You don't actually need to send a time capsule. Life support systems so we're going to leave that alone. All systems are Ooh! Oh, my days. Oh, wow. That is a sub-41. Man. Wow. That's fantastic. What? There was even time you could save on this? I am... Oh wow, that's amazing. And that's not even the fastest resource time we've ever done. You can save another 30 seconds there some time on you could just about do a sub 40 with this but I don't know whether I want to chase that this is nuts though sub 38 is now looking easier and easier <laughs> oh fantastic sub 40 possible yeah performing gravity turn maneuver I'm liking the new um, the new jumping strats not going up the thing, I'm liking that. Oh man. <laughs> wow. Have you ever seen this sequence outside in free cam mode? Yeah, you don't move, do you? Hmm. Did I just unzip? I've got my, uh, my jumper and I'm... <laughs> Oh wow. Minus 39, yeah. What is a wave without the ocean? You barely had to go out of your way for resources except for Kyanite, that really helped. Yeah. They are different. Cheers, dude. They go together. Instead of 41, 48, you got a 40. F exactly. The 48 is. that's the number. We are different. Man. Cheers, Maria. Yeah. Wow, we'll, we'll let the credits roll, because that's what we normally do with these. Wow. Man. I didn't... I didn't think we'd get 
a sub 41 on this. I didn't think I could save that much time on that last segment. I thought it was like 20 seconds, not 39. 39. Man. Sub 41. Do we chase the sub 40? Is that what we do? Beautiful. Do it. <laughs> just just do it. Just do the sub 40. We didn't even need 4,000 attempts for sub 40. <laughs> sub 41. This is like a 4120 at best. Crap just came here. Hmm. Man. Pans out and turns out you've become a reaper human hybrid. Just do the sub 12. Don't chase 40. Sub 40. Chase 39, 48. <laughs> First dream. <laughs> sure. Well. What should I place in my time capsule? Give us a Cyclops shield generator, please. Chase sub 40. You won't see a world record on soon. Didn't know it'd be the second day, though. Man. That's nuts. That is nuts. Welcome home to all Terra. Permission to land will be granted once you have settled your outstanding balance of one trillion credits. One trillion credits. Okay, I'm gonna pop to the loo. And we're gonna think about what on earth we're gonna do. I didn't expect this to happen so I guess we've been streaming for a while three and a bit hours I expected to get like slightly slightly lower the goal was like a, a low sub 41 today no not a goal it was a low 41 so like a 4120 or something not a not a 4048 oh man that is that is nuts St <laughs> world Wixip's world record stood for a massive 14 and a half hours <laughs> And it was a solid 14 and a half hours. <laughs> just you, you just get the sub 40 first. That's the that's the plan, right? Except, oh, I need to add yours to the the graph. Um, I was going to go to the loop. I guess I'll go in a second. We'll do the. We'll show. That we'll bring up the graph. There we go. We'll do that now. Are you not submitting it? I thought you already did. I want submit. It. It's a good run. It's sub 42. Like, it's a fantastic run. Uh, where is this? Let me let me put it in my beautiful graph. Can't put it in if you don't submit it. Why we bully Vixip out of all the categories? Vixip has hardcore, I believe. Yeah. It's not 48, but it is a good run. You still have hardcore and tools. Your hardcore run was pretty sweet. Where do you see world record? He says he won't run creative anymore. Oh. 36.47, not really achievable though. And yeah, you beat, you beat us all on bingo pretty much every time as well. Not on stream though, sure. Hey Chad, I'm doing alright. We just got uh, sub 41 is nutty um, we're just sort of just sort of chilling for a bit because I'm I'm in awe that I'd managed to uh, get that down grind time I guess I'm gonna pop to the loo first I'll be back in a sec
see you, dude. Okay. 